Hello, people. Check this out. Run an abandoned railway line. Well, I like disused railway line. You run a bridge overlooking a road. Look. It's wicked, isn't it? We're here. Lee's here. He's playing with his phone. John's playing with a drone somewhere. It's up there. It's miles away. But we're on the hunt for a uh, disused railway tunnel, which is somewhere in that direction. And there is something else to look at as well today, which is going to be absolutely immense to look at. And I cannot wait. But, for the moment, we just stood here admiring this old railway bridge, which I think is quite pretty. There's somebody's house down there, but it's an old... I can't tell you how long this... I don't even know what line this is, but it's been disused for ages, because you can't even tell no more. But we're going to go on a walk in that direction and find the disused railway tunnel. And I'll make sure to film it for you, because that's going to be absolutely immense. Don't get the secret but, it's, it's a booming day. It's fantastic. I can't wait to go over here as well because behind that fence over there if I can click on that over there in the distance just over there there is something really really good and I can't wait to go and see it turns out a half a mile walk is slightly longer than somebody anticipated I mean it is like 28 degrees we didn't bring any water with us so we're, we're definitely going to shrimp up into some prunes today but other than that I can't see much apart from gravel and trees, but it looks pretty, pretty cool. And there's like these benches that people have made on this wall. You, to be fair, you can't even tell it was a disused railway line at all anymore. The path has become that small. Look, someone's made a pretty bench. A picnic here bench. Picnic bench. I don't know why you'd want to have a picnic here, but, you know, each to their own. Because the ticks leave feeding. Okay. I'm just going to keep walking until I see something interesting. Look, we found the railway tunnel. It's 480 meters long, but all the stuff is on the sign back here. It's 400. It's 480 meters long, and it's really dark. I thought you were gonna, um, you know, find the cyclist with that a second ago. But yeah, it's quite cool, isn't it? We're gonna walk through it now. It's really dark though. There was a gate on it. Oh look, the drone's coming out. Um, just, 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 just for the lols. Just for the gate for dramatic effects. Dramatic effects. It's not like I'm already recording you holding the gate, like. Yeah, but you can edit it. True. And that's what it would look like if it was shut. Caution, uneven service, poor lighting. Cyclists, please dismount. It's quite long for 480 meters, isn't it? It is dark. Don't have that got sunglasses on though, that that might not help. But we've entered the tunnel. We don't know what could happen next. It could just all explode. Bang! It's quite loud though, isn't it? The walls. It's cool. It's gotten proper dark now and I can't see where I'm going. I'm <laughs> oh, like an alien with that behind me. It's cool in here though, isn't it? It's proper cold. It's very nice considering how hot it is anyway. We've been walking for ages and we still haven't found... We have, we've got, you see the very like, small light in the background? That is the exit and it's miles away. You can't even see the entrance behind me anymore. There's no refuge things in these tunnels? No. Wow, well, we should have gone out can't see that. I don't know why. They should be on the walls. Little. Refugees. But there isn't. I imagine because it's only one line. But then again, that still probably wouldn't make any sense. There's a single light beam on the front there, see? Yeah. There's old stuff on the wall. There's the old refuge. They've blocked it off. Look. Get the light on there, put camera in. Let's look for bats. Look at that, that's quite cool. Put your camera in. Come on. 
Hang on, um, yeah, that's quite cool, that. Still not anywhere near closer to the end. You know, as they say, the end is near. What is this light that I'm coming up to? There's a light on the floor here. What is it? What is it? What is it? There's another thing there. Refuge. What is it? Oh, it goes, it goes straight up, don't it? Oh, it gets a bit wet there, don't it? Oh, look, it looks kind of cool on the camera. It looks, it looks a lot. Oh, no. Not, not getting wet today. Where can I stand where I'm not going to get Look at this. That is proper. It goes all the way up. It's a venting shaft for the um, tunnel. That is wicked. <laughs> that is cool. You're about to see something immense. John is about to fly his drone straight up this air shaft. If the footage turns out nice, I will clip it in for you. <laughs> However, if the drone hits the wall, you might not see it. You're brave because I'm walking across that land to get to that. It's going to be fun either way. End up in a bush. I really do like the taste of the uh, condensated water dripping off that. Though. That tastes lovely. Could drink that water, you know? Yeah, you, you, crack, you crack on, mate. Won't catch a drink. Look how cool. Oh, is it not going to work? Well, guys, we, 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 we've shattered dreams and hearts with that one because we can't fly up there. But the, the, entry, the, the exit is miles off in that direction still. Come on, guys, that work is going to be Yay! He's got GPS. No? Yes? No GPS. Very upsetting. So if you want one of them Jones off the TV channel, you know, you know, you can find it in the Yeah, but, 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 like, we, we, yeah, exactly, we could have just brought that one down it. That would have been more funny to flop the tunnel line. Well, I am very upset that you didn't manage to fly straight up the tunnel because you wouldn't let it happen. But this is rather interesting. The exit is growing closer. Yes. The exit is growing closer and closer and closer. And there's another refuge in the wall there that they've bricked up. There's quite a few of them actually. Is there anything in there? Have you found? Oh, so actually, yeah. People are using it as a bin. Exactly. Fantastic. By the way, we've come so far. I don't know if you can just see that little speck of light down there. That is where we've came in. But it's getting significantly lighter, which is quite cool. You don't need a torch, it's, it's merely dark. Yeah, we could actually look at the roof. Yeah, but I can see all that on here because it's got a wicked um, light centre, so I can see all the brickwork and stuff. But it is a very nice walk. If you're in the area. Oh, yeah, but it's like 28 degrees out there, so it's an absolutely fantastic temperature. I can hear a drone powering on, and I know I'm just going to get absolutely destroyed in the back of the neck with it in a minute. But we have exited, well, we are about to exit the tunnel after 480 meters of damp darkness. Oh, look at the alliteration on that. I should, I should have a degree in English. And this is the exit. Oh look, there's a bit of mud on the floor. This is the safe portal. There's a something there. I don't know what that was, but he's gonna sit down and have a break, but we've just exited the tunnel. And it's quite cool. It is actually, I do like, it's quite pretty this bridgeway is. And the fact is that not many people get to see it anymore because it's only used as a walking path. But it is quite pretty. Down there with that tunnel. We've climbed up the little embankment here, and there's another one down there. So, we're gonna try adventure down to get to that one. But getting down there is gonna be uh, a little bit more than anticipated. But I shall see you all if we get down to the bottom. And off that ledge over there, which you've seen in the last clip, of course. And <laughs> there is another railway tunnel. As right here, there's another one. It's a, it's a, I believe it to be the same length as the one we've just come through, 
but there's another one on this side which isn't like open to the public and if you think that we aren't going through it you must be you know slightly I don't know the word for it but the gate's open and we're going straight through and we're going all the way through to the other side and I don't know where the other side of this one goes so join us on our quest through the wilderness Hmm, it's just a bit. It's just a bit muddy. It's not muddy enough though. The second is it. Oh, you can actually see in this one, it's quite cool here. Yeah. Bear in mind the bank's still open, so bear with me, even though there's nobody down here. There you go. Oh, it's proper. <laughs> it's muddy in here. <laughs> Come on, John. Am I? I don't know where I'm stepping, though. That tunnel wall's a bit wet and crusty. Nice. <laughs> this is well fun. We've got 480 metres of stodge. Yeah, a little bit. People can see what they're looking at on the screen, which is all that really matters. If I... Oh, no, don't do that to me. I don't do, re I don't do train water. One of them, and they're the old, they're the old, uh, yeah. They're quite cool. I mean, if I could get a camera, a light on one, I'd be able to see it, but I can't, really. You'll probably find out these weren't cables. These were the wires for points. You know, you've got the double entrance tunnel, that's it, on the single track. Well, it splits, don't it? Well, I imagine it too. But yeah, this is tunnel number two of the day, which I think is quite interesting. Look, they've still got all the paintings on the wall, and the number markings, which is quite cool. It is very bumpy. It's still got ballast in it. I can feel it underfoot. The swing in the middle of the... Whoa, what's that? The swing on the floor in the middle of the tunnel. Somebody get a light on that. Oh my god, it's... it's, it's, it's a... that, that's quite... No, it's just a stick. That's not attached to the wall, is it? No, it's not attached to the wall. I thought we found something. What's that? It's, it's an old... Um, what do you call it? I think. Of some description. But it is quite... Oh, it's stodgy there. It's quite cool in here. Yeah, the old sort. You sure? We ain't even here halfway. I didn't think it was short track, but it was certainly. Tunnel, and right in front of me here is a open... Open refuge, unlike in the last tunnel that we walked down, where there was no open refuges. That's stodgy, you can hear all the ballast again under my feet, but it's quite cool this one is. It's much more fun exploring one where it's not open to the public, unlike one that has been turned into a cycle path. Another one open. Another one, where? On the side here? Yeah. Again, we're coming up to another open refuge in the side of the earth. Uh, on a wall there. Quite cool, aren't they? But oh, wait. oh, I've just ah, my toes. Oh, look at the look at the iron deposits deposit in the wall. So if you've got an iron deficiency, do us a favour. Have a go on that. Now, if I wasn't educated, I'd tell you that is um something that it isn't. But yes, this tunnel is quite cool. Especially the fact that it's still got ballast in it, and it hasn't been turned into. Oh, look at that, that's totally not dangerous at all, is it? The fact that the, uh, the bricks kind of come, no wonder it's shut. So guys, if this video never surfaces and you just happen to find it in about 20 years time, yes, we were troping for a tunnel we shouldn't have been in. Look at the old tin can, that's vintage, that is. Pass, pass me torches a second here. Um, look at the vintage tin can. It's vintage. <laughs> oh man, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm quite hungry. Should I give it a lick? <laughs> that's the hook in the wall, isn't it? Or just a bit of a, a bit of wood that's kind of rotted over yeah, 500. Yes, the staple of any day out. A can of Fosters. But. Oh, what we got? We got some monster as well, and we've got a can of brew dog. At least they're qualified and drink. People have had a fire in it. 
Tins of beans. Someone's been wall camping what they've been eating. We don't know. Why have they been eating? It is a baked beans, yeah. Baked beans and tomato soup. That's where we find out someone's living in here. It's not being stored. For a tunnel. Oh, what well, is this? It was that haunted tunnel, wasn't it? The TikTok has come and stayed in. I mean, yeah. I would explain why it's so cold down here. There's another refuge. Yeah, it's a bit of Dr. Pepper. That's what we're talking about. But all in all, the dis disused ones that aren't open to the public are more fun than the ones that are open to the public. We have reached the end of the tunnel. That is where we entered all the way down there. It's a nice little bit of graffiti on the wall there. That's quite cool. But there is a bike lock on the gate but there is a nice human sized yeah a, a human sized hole in the fence that we are going to squeeze through and I'm going to keep recording because I am fantastic at this come on go on sidling boat <laughs> right camera through first yeah I'll video you get it through video nape for the escaping yeah. the tunnel See, if you ever want to do this type of stuff, guys, now, uh, this is no disrespect to anybody, but if you want to do this type of stuff and sneak through really small gaps, you need to be you need to laugh as malnourished as I am. But it's quite cool. I'm going to walk down here and see if I can capture the tunnel from this side. This is where we just come out. Some graffiti, of course. But it's quite cool, yeah? Look at it. There's two tunnels in one go. Now on a hunt for a path up because John climbed up there and I've got no grip on my trainers. So I... Here. there isn't a path here. Oh, there's one to my right. Yeah, that goes up that way. That might be easier actually. No, I'd love to walk across the top of it, but I can't because there's no path. So I'm trying to find that one. Which one's the size easier, John? This one's got less. Oh, we're talking mathematical now. We're talking gradients. Go on, I'm going to film you. This is going to be good stuff. You know we're going to go on before. Come on, Explorer Lee. <laughs> Did you just call me that again? I just called you Explorer Lee. Dora the Explorer. No, I said you're Explorer Lee. Sounds like Dairy Lee, doesn't it? Dairy Lee. Maybe one day they'll call you Clever Lee. Have you got the wall to hang on to? No, that's not Ha! Go on, you're going to do this. It's making some legit content. It's not that bad, no, it's actually got some little bushes wrong there. Just little bushes and stuff. Anyway, Lee is making his way up there. Like a, like a, like a great mountain goat. No, you don't. There's a wasp buzzing around my ear holes. Well, Lee made it up there nicely. I will reconvene with you once I've made it up this not so small hill. Uh, you have to bear with me one moment. Up the verge, as you seen in the last clip. I got up a bit. I don't know where the tunnels have gone because we kind of went on a little diversion walk and I forgot to uh, see where I was going. There's a first tunnel down there. There's the first one, that's the second one we found. The place. second tunnel is just beyond them bushes, and the first tunnel that you're seeing is over here. And now we're walking down the path to get to it. It's a bit quick though. But it's been quite fun going through these tunnels and going on these excursions. See, here's the first tunnel we walked through. You'll be able to see it here. I'm going to go uh, film the top of it, which is over ow, which has been attacked so in the ankles. In this first one. This part, you should, you should see the second, I don't know, it's far away. Yeah. Here is, if you go across ow, that that's there, stuck in my ankles. You should see the portal for the other one. Yeah. Oh, God, no, the so, here, down, down here, there, is yeah. the top yeah, of the first down, down. No. tunnel we went into. If see? You, you see I don't want to walk in the, the duct. Because there's a drainage duct there. And if you go over here, if you carry on walking here without tripping and falling over, 
in the process. Ow, 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 ow. I'm being stung to... I mean stung to death. Yeah. And when I stand on this ridge over here and walk through a million and one spidey webs, here is the entrance to the other tunnel. The one that was uh, not open to the public. And I climbed up that ridge over there. If I stop getting eaten by spiders, I'll show you. This ridge just down here. I walked up that. I went round here. I'm getting eaten by spiders. It's really annoying. And that's the one that was closed. That's and this the is the closed. This is the one we just come out of. And then we walked up there. Because you walked across the top of the ridge. But here it is. And the other one. It's just there. Beyond that bush, look. If I walk further over here, you can get it kind of in frame. But here are the both disused railway tunnels. That one's not open to the public. That one's a bike path. But I can say, they are a very interesting walk. Explore. Well, yeah, an explore slash walk. I'd do it again in a heartbeat. And if you want to get down to this tunnel here, Ooh. that's a zoom. If I click you, you just walk down there. And you've got it sorted. Now we've got a trip back across, back across the top and down to walk back to where we were going. It's going to be quite interesting.